Four members of the same family are dead after a car crashed into a tree on the city's north side. The vigil held for all of them tonight at the crash site near 26 in Townsend. And that is where we find Aaron Mabin. He's live for us tonight with how they are being remembered. Well, Amy, it was an emotional vigil, a lot of tears tonight. Dozens of people packed this sidewalk and stood next to this growing memorial here at 26 in Townsend, remembering those four family members who died and that sole survivor, a little girl who survived. Bow our heads for a moment. At 26 in Townsend. Oh, gracious and heavenly Father. Prayer helps with the pain. Right now, Father, they hurt me. And they need you right now. Dozens seeking spiritual strength after a crippling, violent crash killed four members of their family. Just continue to pray for us. We need prayer. 29 year old Larry Williams and his fiancee, 22 year old Ayanna Hill, died after the car they were in slammed into a tree. Their two young children, Yana and Larry the Fourth, were also killed. Investigators say the force of the impact split the car in half. As long as we do it together, we can get past this tragedy. The wreck happened Friday night. Investigators believe speed played a part in the single vehicle crash. Authorities say Williams was behind the wheel and somehow lost control. He loved his kids. He would never put them in harm's way. He loved them. As the pain mounts, there's a miracle, a sole survivor. My one-year-old granddaughter, Ariana, Williams was released this evening from the hospital and is doing well. A family grateful for the love they've been shown. To the community, I thank you for the cars, for the balloons. Family members say Ariana hurt her leg. She did have uh, some stitches that she needed, but besides that, she is doing just fine, surrounded by loved ones tonight. Family members are finalizing the funeral arrangements for her four family members. We're live at 26 in Townsend tonight. Aaron Mabin, Fox 6 News. A little bit of hope for that family. Thank you, Aaron.